What's up, friends of the good mood? This is Money, and you want more free for all? Really? Is that correct? What I've heard in the comments recently? Then, ladies and gentlemen, let's go with free for all. I have a new favorite toy in War Robots, and uh, you've probably already seen it a few times. And I want to show it to you guys, guys and gals again. It's the Ox Minos with the new, uh, you know, Sonic weapons. It's completely crazy. In this video, you're gonna see how even on Canyon, on a sniper map, this. Uh, Ox Minos is just completely carrying everything. Okay, there's just no beating it. Impossible. It will kill you no matter what. You're gonna see this here in the second match on Canyon, okay? So stay tuned for that. But first, let's enjoy my own Warabots account here, absolutely ruining whatever meta they can throw at me with my old Ravanas, with my Strider Boy, and so on, okay? So let's go for it. And also, by the way, we have a brand new giveaway going on since yesterday. Day, okay, 200 new emugis, not just any emugi, the new ardent emugis, 200 of those are being given away here on the channel right now. So in the top right corner, also video description and pinned comment, you find the link directly to this giveaway. Make sure to check it out, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it yet, and get your ardent emugi, or at least, well, the, the chance to win it, okay? Because it would be a false promise if I told you you can definitely win. But, um, you know, there's a chance for it, and uh, why not use it, right? So, uh, this is my Typhon boy with uh, the, uh, the uh, I don't know why I'm, I'm just adding boy to everything. Strider boy, Typhon boy. Um, yeah, so this is my Typhon with the uh, 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 mace. I think mace is the weapon, yeah? Hammer is the big one, I think mace is the middle one, and... Cudgel the small, like, I think. Sometimes I confuse the me medium and light and heavy versions of weapons. Um, more like medium and me uh, light. Heavy I typically get right. Anyways, uh, this kill right there, enemy six, it would be such an amazing kill if <laughs> if I wasn't running out of ammo right when he has zero HP. Look, I only need one more shot. And I can't do it because I'm out of ammo, and there we go. Uh, but yeah, we have some powerful Seraphs here. We have uh, the uh, the Claw Jaw uh, and um, Talon version of Anglers. We have Imugis here in this match. Dude, this is a meta match. This is free for all with meta players, okay? So it's not just pushovers that I'm pushing over. <laughs> no, it's actually meta players that I'm pushing over with my Strider Boy. And uh, the Typhon and the Ravana and of course the Minos boy. <laughs> okay, enough with the boy stuff. Uh, uh, my Minos. Okay, uh, that thing is really fun. Uh, and again, in the second match, you'll see how this thing will absolutely ruin even on Canyon, because I didn't expect this. I thought it's like these weapons are similar to shotguns. The further you fire, the less you hit, and it's not going to work very well anymore, right? Here, look how short he's not stealthed. He just landed, and I'm attacking him again, and Bop, he's already back in stealth. It's crazy. Freaking Imugis, man. So trollish. Um, and they can fire at you at the same time while being in stealth. It's crazy. Uh, and he's got those lasers now. So this is also a very powerful meta Imugi, but I'm playing my Strider. And that means I can be tricky. I can be a real troll right there, coming out of nowhere, like, pop, my kill. Yeah, so I thought on Canyon, how could this be any good? The Minos... Okay, maybe it's okay on Canyon, but uh, with these shotgun-like weapons, how could this be good, right? I mean, you, you don't hit anything at long range anymore. Uh, but the matter of fact is, these weapons are sick even at that range. But let's first have a look at this in this video here. So there's already an Aether Titan. A mad powerful beast with a new lance and glaive. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> <laughs> Thank you, because I'm sure some of you guys <laughs> actually did say bless you or something. <laughs> and for those who did, thank you. Um, yeah, let's go and attack this guy. He's mad annoying. Um, he, look how much damage he just did with his angler. Uh, but he realized, wait a minute, that's a titan. And he doesn't want to fight me, and uh, I'm already preparing my high fire rate. And, brrrp, and, oh man, are you kidding me, dude? You're still here? Really? Um, trying to deal some extra damage, but he keeps healing everything I do to him, and now he goes back into his ability, but it's it's okay I'm just gonna kill him even blinded. Don't worry about it. Here we go and pop there he goes nice The charge actually killed him the running charge so and I'm keeping my high fire rate going see I just brrp, 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 brrp. Because I do this I keep the full firepower going and as soon as it's possible to hit pop I get the instant kill and here's the thing I learned by playing this on my own account here 
Um, it's my mo most favorite toy in War Robots now. This thing is, it's, it's overpowered because of the weapons mostly, because there are more powerful titans than the Minos, but this weapon itself makes this thing such a beast. You can just push people no problem with the double running. As you just saw here, uh, they can't avoid the combat because you have this ability to just get anybody and uh, to get anyone anywhere. A and then this firepower is even allows you to get like uh, powerful Aether Titans at range and whatnot. Look how quickly he's going down. Dude, he almost just died. He also did a tremendous amount of damage to me though because I wasn't running my reflector. And these weapons, Lance and Glaive, are just insane at range. Um, but with this firepower, I can even drop him in his ability up there. No problem. Seven seconds, reload, eight seconds. It's not that much, that longer. I, I wonder, was it not longer on the test server before? I feel like the, the reload was 10 seconds or so on it. And uh, as it came to the live server, I think it was now... Uh, only eight seconds, right? So they scratch two seconds reload in the conversion from test server to live server. If I'm correct, I mean, I could be wrong. It's just something I feel like I remember. But I'm not sure if it's true. Maybe you guys remember this. I, I would have to actually just go back and watch my own videos, but I'm a lazy bastard, so I'm not doing this. <laughs> I'm just joking, guys. But, uh, <laughs> let's go and kill that angler. No, what is it? It's an angler, yeah. And here I'm just keeping, brr, 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 keep shooting so that the high fire rate is ready and brr, oh, he got another stealth. Dude, really? So, but by shooting the uh, other dude for a second, I just uh, convinced him to go into his flight, which means that the flight is already used. I got my kill, so that's sweet. But as you know, these guys just go into stealth all the time. Why was I not shooting him? I was just missing my shots for a second there. Oh man, look how fast he's running. Look how fast he's running, and now I'm reloading. And he's going into a flight, because he's so scared. Yeah, you better be scared. You know how I'm killing him now? It's funny. It's insanely funny how I kill him. Um, I just, um... Wait a minute. Oh, that's right. I'm not killing him just yet. He still has last stand, so I'm dropping him to last stand. Then I keep my high fire rate going. And when his last stand goes away, he's face shifting. God damn it, now I'm reloading. But you know how I'm killing him now? <laughs> by using my reflector. He's starting to fire at me. I'm activating reflector Boop, And he kills himself with it double kill Deserved yes, absolutely deserved my kill nice, uh, but actually it was deserved because man this guy just he should have done di died so long ago So we have two uh, charges ready. I'm just need to know what it is that he's coming with He's got lockdown on it, too But that doesn't ma ma mean anything to me because I actually does do have um uh, what's it called here? The anti-control. So I'm keeping one of my running modes ready. Because if I had run in again, I could not have had a second running mode. And uh, what I want to do is, I want to run away so that he gets pushed away. And he can't actually catch me. And then he comes out of his ability and he's done. Right? If I had used both at active abilities at the beginning, I could not have run away anymore. And he would have blinded me. Um, but uh, this way, by saving it, I forced him into his ability by shooting him. And man... Nothing has a chance against this. They just get eaten alive, dude. There's no chance for them. He respawned that powerful Kepri, and I'm running in with my... Um, uh, what's it called here? With my charge abilities, with my reflector running at the same time. He's got two stealths, apparently. But after that second stealth, I think we have him. Brrrp. I lose one of my weapons, but then I'm just running over him, man. I'm just gonna run right over. Dude, this is insane. Again, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, gosh. 14 kills, 8 million damage. No problem. And now we are in Canyon, as promised. And um, again, if you're uh, if you're enjoying this video, guys, and you're also surprised about how well the Minos will do in long-range engagements, um, then yeah, consider subscribing and also stay tuned for uh, for the giveaway that's going on right now, right? Uh, the 200 ardent Imugis. So my first uh, battle or my first robot did not really stand much of a chance. I was. Um, Caught between two stupid boring anglers. The next guy, uh, he's got stealth even on it. Um, and is he going to get into his ability? Oh my god, how long did that stealth go? Did you see the duration on that stealth? Dude, that felt like 20 seconds. I know it wasn't 20 seconds, but in a free for all match like this, this was an eternity. This was an absolute eternity of stealth. Thankfully, I did get the stealth, uh, the kill after. And I have my ability ready. I'm running my own Seraph here on my account. He does have his ability ready, so I'm sure he's gonna use it. No, I think that's face shift now. And then he's using his ability. 
Yep, trying to dodge his uh, his uh, walking mode or his going somewhere. I have to reload, and he just drops me through my last stand, unfortunately. But maybe I can grab the kill. Yeah, those double redeemers, man. Remember they were buffed by 40%. Look, he's just dashing left and right for no reason. He's trying to deal damage with the dash ability that he has, but there's not coming any dash, uh, because turns out, uh, I was behind cover. Now he's dashing underneath me, it's a good move, but I'm still hitting him, and boom, eventually he goes down. Um, very nice. Whoa, he, ki he got killed fast. What killed him so fast, Pulsar? Enemy 5 killed him with Pulsar so mad fast, and I think he was shield breaking him too, because I believe he did have his shield up when he got killed there. So enemy 5 must be running a setup with Pulsars. Yeah, I think he's got a Typhon with Pulsars. Very dangerous, very powerful, especially on a map like Canyon. It's crazy. But yeah, let me show you um, how the Minos is going to carry this match. <laughs> I just snuck that kill, no problem. And then I can fly up here because for some reason Pixonic allows to, uh, Seraph to fly insanely long. I don't know Pixonic, really. Is it, is it not too long how the Seraph flies? To me it seems like this thing should not be flying this long. I mean, he just crosses in the entire map with it, no problem, right? I'm going into my ability now, but it's too late and I already got taken down. Alright, so is it time for the Minos? It is time! For my most favorite toy in War Robots now. The Minos with, um, not Squall, what's it called? Uh, ugh, I have to wait for a kill to see the name. Um, forgot the name of the weapon. Um, but, yeah, these weapons are just insane. I'm just eyeballing what's going on here, because everybody is running Seraphs now. So, they're all invincible during their flight. I just need to... And also, oh yeah, what I was gonna say, I learned that you can, um... You can prepare your firing, high fire rate, by just firing a few times, right? You don't have to deplete 30% of your firing before it starts. You just have to th fire for like 5 or 6 seconds. But not straight. You can fire... Rip, 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 and you have full firepower left and you're already in your high firing state. And that's really crazy. You don't have to fire empty the first 30% and then get into this. You can just start with 100% and make pop, one shot, one shot, one shot, one shot. And now you're in your high firing state without having wasted any time on getting there. Now, you see, this is when we fire with full firepower now. And he loses so much health so quickly. And this is probably a level 150 uh, Minos there. Why he's using his reflector now is beyond me. It does not seem like a very useful time to drop it while I was reloading. So I'm waiting for it. For him to land and now full firepower. And that's it. Boom. Thanks to my reflector I was barely taking any damage. And that monstrously powerful Minos Titan. That is really... The, it used to be the most powerful brawler in existence. Got completely snacked. Getting this kill, getting this kill, snack, 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 all mine. <laughs> now, of course, the enemy is going to start bringing their own titans now. Um, and the, the first one we have already dropped. The second one is also a, a, a luchador from the looks of it. So he's using face shift now. It's not his ability, because in his ability he would be faster. Now he's coming in his ability. And I keep my firing. Brup, brup, brup. And by doing this, I keep the fire full firepower going. And, uh, and then I almost dropped it. Unfortunately, it wasn't quite enough for a kill. I have to reload now. And he's going to have his running mode ready. So I know that. His, uh, his ability is ready. And I'm just going to follow him. And the other guy is going to activate his, which is not the best idea. Because that means he can't fire. That means I get the kill, definitely. And now I still have the second one. And look how chanceless he is. Ah, dang it. Okay, I didn't, I didn't know he got... Um, another uh, stealth there. Okay, and I'm slowed by a battleship somehow. Okay, that's pretty nasty right now. Oh, and now I ran in. That means I'm gonna get blinded. Oh, that is a bad situation right now, dude. Alright, alright, but I'm still here. Reflector's ready. I'm activating it and here we go. Finally gotten my kill. Also shot him for just one second and he loses 20% of his health. Um, thankfully with battleship support, I can get myself some HP back. And is he going to use his reflector? Did he have it already? I didn't see it. I didn't see that he already used his reflector. 
I'm I'm really lucky here. I'm not using uh, losing my um, I'm not losing my weapons yet. See if I can drop him. Oh no, I can't. Uh, I feel the firepower from the left, so I'm going away from him because he only has 500 meters range. Can I kill him from here? No, I can't. But I need to fill up my battleship so I get more HP. But I also have the Titan Repair Amplifier, so I'm am actually slowly regenerating my health. And because I already took so much damage, it's not that slow anymore. I'm actually regenerating relatively quickly. And uh, Kepri, no chance, man. Especially with the reflector running. And see here, we're on, we're on Canyon. We're on a sniper map. And with a shotgun-like setup, we're actually easily dominating this. And it's because I'm waiting for both of my running abilities. And once both of these run abilities are ready, I'm just gonna go in and at uh, attack them. There is a... Uh, maybe I can force the guy. Okay, let's go this way. Coming in. He used many of his dashes before. He doesn't have so many anymore. And... Boots! What? He survived it. Okay, that was pretty lucky for him. Mm. But he almost died, and it was, uh, it was almost that he died. But no chance. Absolutely chance as the guy. Okay, activating my reflector. And also with the Titan Repair Amplifier, people can no longer get through my resistance, and that's really crazy. Okay, he's using his ability. I kept one of my ability runs, or even two of them, and I can just walk away from it. Comes out of his ability and pop. No chance. <laughs> it's so crazy, man. This is such a beast setup, ladies and gentlemen. So yeah, uh, I did 6, 15 kills, 9 million damage on Canyon. And um, yeah, tell me what you think. I, it's my most favorite new toy here. And in this case, it's even a powerful one. Normally, I choose things that are not necessarily super powerful. But I feel like, you know, I could... If you put this on Aminos, it's still not quite as ridiculous on as on some other although i feel like the minos is making maybe even making the best use of it because of his uh, you know he's bound to the ground he's not flying although i think maybe an aether titan could also be insanely good with it maybe we have to test this but for now let's leave it as that thank you all for watching have a good uh, good day and don't forget the giveaway see you around manny signing off bye bye